I'm at the end of the brown, so the 41 brown for this particular row. I need to snug up my, so I hold on the end, end of the stitch here, I snug up the white that I've been carrying along. So I hold my last stitch on this side so that I don't pull that too tight. And on the left hand side here, I pull the white um, as, as snug as I can without um, distorting the fabric. Then I'll be switching to the next spool of yellow. So on this side, we've got this spool of yellow. The brown then can be reattached. I'll pull my end of the brown back through so that it's laying on the wrong side of the fabric. I will attach the brown back so that as I'm moving my fabric, it doesn't um, get lost or re need to be reattached. And then for the yellow, I'm still carrying along my white. Oops. I carry along the white. I'll be picking up the yellow. So switching to yellow, I pull it through the last two brown loops. Snug up the brown just a little bit so that it um, holds that stitch down. And then we'll move on to a little crochet here. my first stitch. So I need 11 yellow, two, three, four. I haven't undetached my yellow yet here, so I'm going to unspool that a little bit and set it in front of me so I can pull from it, draw from it, and organize the ends here, and then do another double. So we need 11, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, oops, and 11. So it's a double crochet, so I pull through the first two, and then I'll be switching to white. I've already snugged the white, so I'm going to just grab one of these um, little whites and, and hold tight and just snug it through the yellow um, so that the, the white lays flat in there. Now, again, um, kind of crochet hook goes on the fabric. Take my spool, make sure that it's going to the wrong side of the fabric. Reattach it with the pin, the clothes pin. So holding that kind of right there. Um, as I flip over to the other side, I just want to make sure that all of this yarn kind of stays in place. You know, you can do a much better job of just kind of uh, winding it up if you like. So that it's like a butterfly like that. And then basically I just pin it down. I just grab as much yarn as I can and pin it down. So then we'll be finishing up this row with uh, switching back to white. There's 30 white on the end of this row. So switch back to white. That's the 11th yellow. So now we're gonna go back to the white. One, two, and so on. Three, and finish off to the end of the row.